So this is the Turk flower, and right now it's just running a demo program with some IR sensors so that it can catch a little ball or it can catch your hand. And you'd be able to attach different sensors too, like a light sensor. Maybe you want the flower to wake up when you turn the lights on in the morning, or you could have a temperature sensor and it reacts to the temperature. And you could also read an RSS feed of the weather so that maybe it reacts when it's sunny outside. So in our lab where we have no windows, we could have the flower tell us what the weather's like. And you would be able to customize it as well. So right now we just have little paper white petals on here, but it's something that kids could decorate any way they want, make different shapes. And hopefully once you've built the flower using our step-by-step -step recipe, you'd feel empowered to go and make your own design as well. So it will give you the experience to see where to buy different types of parts and how to put them together. And once you've had your hands dirty, gone through it once, then our hope is that people will make changes or make their own designs. And you can also program it. We have software so that you can program it with um, in Java, or you can program it with a little visual programming interface that's great for middle school age. You know, you don't need to have any programming experience.